God bless you and greetings to you in the wonderful name of our living Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. And our Heavenly Father, Yahuwah Elohim. <clears throat> I received this message on Friday, 418, 2014. Then it goes as follows. Son of Man, write, Things appear normal as the word celebrate, excuse me, as the world celebrates Easter weekend. They go about shopping and planning get-togethers in the U.S., while in other parts of the world, my people are being led to the slaughter. In America, the people, my people, continue to go on with things as though there will be no change nor sudden stopping of the life they know and love. My people, my people, repent, repent, repent. You have been taught lies for truth, and you don't even know it. <clears throat> my people are told lies about what is truly happening, lies about what has already happened, lies about what is about to happen. Come unto me and I will give you the true manna, the truth, not more lies. I will help you to prepare for what is coming, not tell you more lies, and continue to say everything is fine when it is not. I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man comes to the Father but by except by me is still true today as it was nearly 2,000 years ago when I first spoke it. I am the source of abundance. My storehouses are full, says the Lord. If you need something in the physical, then call on me. If you need something in the spiritual, then call on me. I give you the true riches, the true abundance, the glory of which never fades away. It hurts my heart to see so many of my people in needless pain and suffering. I did not intend it this way. The adversary, Satan, has deceived the whole world and everyone in it. He has caused the abundance of supply to become less abundant, the perfection to become corrupted the harmony to become dis or unharmonious, the balance <clears throat> I had placed in the earth to become unstable. Therefore, I shall take rulership from his perverted hands and give it to my son, Yahushua. Satan will fight against me in this, but he shall not prevail. I am the great I am, the Most High, the Almighty Elohim. Who can stand against me? Satan. The time of the Great Tribulation draws near. Are you ready? My people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge. Sound the alarm, son of man, sound the alarm, so they can be warned and given time to prepare. The up and coming days shall come quickly. Suddenly they will appear. I still have many lost and perishing in the world. Will you help me to find them, son of man? Continue to bring forth my word, so that the lost may be found, the sinners brought to repentance, and the nations of the world warned before the great and notable day of the Lord is upon them. Continue to cry out, warn my people, encourage the workmen, their labor will not go unrewarded. My rewards and treasure know no limits, and I am, a, and I am generous to my faithful, says the Lord. <clears throat> my inheritance is vast, and I want to share it with my faithful brothers and sisters. Be kind one to another. Stop backbiting, bickering, accusing, name-calling. This is not what I've called you to do. The body of mind needs to be walking in unity, harmoniously, not filled with divisions and strife. Remember, 
I hold you accountable for your actions and all is being recorded whether it be good or bad and there will be a day of reckoning. Let that day be a day of rejoicing and blessing not a day of sorrow and shame. As we approach the finish line don't become weary in well-doing. Continue to reach for the finish line so your reward will be full. I love you my children. Stay in fellowship with me. Stay in the ark. Continue to pray, pray, pray for the lost, the backslidden, family and friends, people at work, the persecuted church. Help the poor and the less fortunate. Pray for your government and leadership. Pray for the lukewarm church that they can catch on fire for me before I come. I love you. I care for you. You are my special dear children. I'm coming back soon. Will you be found worthy at my sudden appearing? So, <clears throat> that's what uh, the Lord shared on 4-18-2014. Um, until next time, may the Lord bless you.